Well, I really think that tech is, uh, it separates itself from other colleges because every, you can get an education, but tech educates you on how to deal with adversity. And it puts you through the ringer to the point where you gotta learn how, you gotta develop your own attitude. You know, it's not for everybody. Golf is so, so great because it, um, it teaches you so much about character and um, integrity and, and um, along the way, you know, you, you have a chance to give back to golf and, and in Tech certainly, you know, it, I earned a scholarship at Georgia Tech, which is, you know, phenomenal that golf could afford someone that. And um, I use that Tech head cover to remind me, you know, of, of what that was all about. I think it's about passing the baton in a way. You know, when I came to college, I knew that I was stepping into some big shoes. Uh, David Duvall was in school with me, and uh, he was the best player in, in the college game. So um, I knew that I was going to learn from him, and that the pressure was on me to step in. Maybe not to step into that role of being the best player in college, although I ended up getting there my senior year. But uh, the pressure was on to carry on with what he was doing, and then after me, those guys had the pressure to carry on what I did and what all of our teams did. But the team unity okay. definitely is alive when you have the, the passing of the baton down from team to team. The Tech players do seem to stick together a little bit, and uh, I, I really don't know why that is. I mean, I think maybe when you go through, when you go through Georgia Tech, you maybe, you know, you're, you're going through a little bit more of a gauntlet, and so it's forced you, it forces you together to lean on the other guys a little bit more, and so you build a bond. And so I think Tech taught me a lot about how to deal with things in my career that had come up outside the golf course more than just how to play par fours and par fives, but, but how to deal with stuff that life throws at you.